Yeah, after doing my interviews, I've learned a good amount of people have already been laid off. The rest fear they might be next. Now, I did speak with one man off camera. He says every day he goes into work, he fears it might be his last. They're never a good feeling to get laid off. Mike Fiedler got laid off from his energy sector job before COVID-19 hit. It was just the same thing, just lower, lower oil prices, lower gas prices. He says the oil and gas industry has been hurting for a while, but he never expected the price to drop into the negatives per barrel. But that doesn't make sense. Like, can I go sell my gas to somebody right now? But all joking aside, he said this is dangerously bad for our economy. You're just facing layoffs everywhere. I spoke with one man today who doesn't want to be identified, he says six people have either been laid off or furloughed as soon as COVID-19 hit. And now that oil is dropping so low in price, he knows there's more layoffs coming. He just prays he's not next. Nobody's buying any jet fuel. Same thing, no one's driving. OEPA Chairman Dewey Bartlett and other officials say because of COVID-19 and the low prices, 10 to 20,000 Oklahomans are predicted to lose their jobs in the next few months. It has a lot of repercussions. Now, officials tell me this will affect our economy as a whole. They say those workers who do get laid off, they probably won't be going shopping, going to restaurants, or spending any of that extra money once our state opens back up. Reporting live in Oklahoma City tonight, Aaron Bue, KOCO 5 News.